the Greeks could rule the world. Alexander did, but Alexander is dead. The world turns. What was may come again. The fates still spin the web of men's life. Hello guys, this is Warrior here, and we're back with another Rome Total War Remastered Macedonian Campaign episode. So in the last one, the fate of Capia was decided, which is here. Now we have the push towards Rome. It is heavily defended by Roman troops, plus a very healthy garrison. Hopefully we'll be able to smash them in the field and then assault Rome itself, but we shall see. Once we take this, it's literally the Julii that remain and their three settlements, and then Rome will be vanquished. Uh, Carthage is attacking them there, and I also need to get a diplomat. That's not my diplomat. That's not my diplomat either. Where is my diplomat? My lord. I need to find him and send him south is what I need to do. I just gotta figure out. Okay. There's the agent list around here somewhere. No. Not that yet. Um, there we go. Agent panel. My lord. No. Spy. Yes, spy. My lord. Diplomat. Yes, my lord. You. Carthage, I do believe, yes, receives one of these settlements. Yes, and we'll see if it's still in their hands. We will talk to them. Hopefully we get some trade rights, maybe an alliance. That would be good. That would secure our western border. And then we could start expanding in the east, which is what I'm wanting to do. Recreating Alexander's empire and all that. All right, stone walls are going up. They're almost done. That's fine. Put in paved roads. We need paved roads wherever we can get them. Stone walls would be nice wherever we can get them, because that'll also help with expansion. Governor's Palace, that and that. Sparta, what do you have? Paved roads, that and a port would do me good. Alright, how are we doing here? Uh, Carthage is just hanging out. What do we have here? Pretty good troops would appear, and we're training. Yeah, yeah, okay. So we're waiting a little bit, and then we'll move forward. This fleet. Um, no, we don't need to go after Carthage. Uh, Julia would uh, probably be the people we could go after. So we'll go after them. That's rebels. That's Greek city states. So and the Greek city states are around here. They're probably fighting with Pontus or Seleucids. Ooh, there's a bunch of fighting going on here. All right, so. <clears throat> The fate of Rome. Um, we also have this force going up here. We'll see what they get into. But all eyes turn to Rome. So let's see what happens here. So they're being reinforced by a very depleted force. And the garrison is coming out. Wow, that is a very large cavalry force. Alright, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine cavalry. Plus this, that's ten. Here, ooh, okay, that's a yeesh. Okay, um, we're gonna have to be defensive. That is for sure. We do have ballistas. We'll see what we can get ourselves into. If we can crush them in the field, that would be the better of the options. And killing as many of the generals as possible would also be in our best interest. Because if we kill their generals, we can also regicide them. Destroying Rome, conquering Rome, is one of the objectives. It's just holding Rome. So, gotta defeat the Julia. I did not declare war on them. The Blutii declared war on me. So I will exterminate them as only a Greek can. Utterly and totally. The heirs of Alexander do not show mercy. No, they do not. So we shall not. Alexander never did, so we won't. Now, I'm going to have to be very defensive. Not turtly, but very defensive. I have a lot of phalanxes, which is good for a defensive battle. Kind of pull for everything else. I do have archers and uh, missile troops and enough cavalry to... We'll hold it back and we won't strike out because our general's bodyguards will rip us a new one. But, if the general's bodyguards fancy charging into pikes, uh, that won't go over well. I just can't let my pikes get flanked. Mm. So, let's see what we can get ourselves into. 
Wow, these loading times are a lot. At about a minute. Oh, there it goes. Let's see Today if it speech. is a green day in the sight of the gods. They do not rejoice to see brave men die. By night, though, they will rejoice in a victory. This I pledge to you. Nothing like a good old speech to rile up the troops. All right, so they'll all be coming in from their south behind them. All right, so what do we have? We have this big forest. That's not going to help us. Mm. We have a heal, but heals don't really mean much in this game. Not like they do in later games. Heals actually can help you or hurt you. So really, <sighs> the forest isn't going to help me either. You'll be one group. You will be another unit. Very substandard cavalry, that's for sure. All pikes. All pikes. You're together. All archers. Yep. Sam Knights, you will be weighted on the right flank. Illyrian mercenaries, you're going to be in skirmish, and you're going to be behind the main line. I'll rush you forward to skirmish or flank, depending on what's the best option there. Hmm. They're all going to be coming in from the rear. I could charge these forward. Probably need to dominate one area of the map and then take it over and then fight like this instead of... Uh, I will see. The enemy have brought up more reinforcements in a futile attempt to save themselves. Alright, so that is Astadi, Velites, and Terrarii. That's their cab force. Alright, we'll just let them come together. I think that'll be the safer of the options. Right, Pikes. You are going to extend the line. Archers, you're going to do the same. Widen out. Sam Knights, you're going to do like so. You're going to move over. Ballista, move up. You're going to move forward in front of the pikes. Let's go. I want a nice wide pike line. Pikes, what are you doing? Move. Nope. We'll exchange some missiles with the Hastati. That force I'm not worried about. This cavalry force is what I'm mostly worried about. It's a lot of cavalry. The infantry we can deal with. It's this cavalry. It's all general calves, so we get bonuses and all that other crap. We have armor upgrades, which is going to help them not very much. Especially when that much is going to get shot at you. Throw your javelins. Bring them down a little bit. That'll make them rush forward. Run back. Keep firing at them. Yeah, that should shred them. Keep firing. They use their javelins. They're gonna charge our lines. They are gonna charge our lines. It's very foolhardy of you. Push into them. What are you doing? Fire at the Chari. Keep firing at the Militaes. There. Ballista. I need you to 
dash about face and turn. Turn into them. Turn onto them. Terrari are shaken. 118 of the Hastati are broken. How far is that? Eh, that might reach. Trying to push through. Caught him. Perfect. God be praised. There goes the, enemy the captain's dead. Fear makes a home in our enemy's hearts. Captain's dead. Reform the lines. Reform the lines. Alright, those are starting. You attack the equites. You around. Stop firing. It's fine for now. Bring down those equites. Seriously gonna charge a pike phalanx head on. It's not gonna end well. Fire there. Don't. And now they flee. What we got? Sam Knights. Alright. What do we got? Roman General, Roman General. Stadi. Shattered my Macedonian calf. News is killing them. Get them. The enemy general oh, is running away. This is no way for a leader to behave, but in battle, it is beyond belief. Ah, move. The Roman leader lies yes. dead on the battlefield. Perfect. Few Greeks will weep to see such a man die. Your gallant general has fallen and caused these troops much heartache. Uh oh. Much That's better not to good. Have That's I not good. I lost my general. That's not good. At all. Damn it. Now everybody's breaking. Well. I had my head up my butt and uh, However, we may have some rallying. Possibly. Serves me right for trying to um, charge them down. These guys are running. They're running. What are you doing? Go up to that Roman general. They've broken. That Roman general. Wow, they didn't even break. They, they literally just bolted as soon as they got there. That's ridiculous. Romans are wavering too. If I hadn't lost my general, this would have been an easy victory. Damn it. I'm moving in behind them, that's gonna get crushed. Well, this is highly unfortunate. 
they're all running well it's all because my general died damn it uh, that's irritating that's one phalanx unit it's doing rather well nobody else is Quite a catastrophe. The enemy has beaten our army. So we lost our general and the bulk of our fighting strength. Well, that's very unfortunate. Because I had my head up my butt. Oh well. That sucks. I knew morale in this in this game is very finicky, but it's okay. it's okay. They won't be able to seize Capri. I'll, I'll be able to bring up reinforcements to hold it. So, I'm not too worried about that. It just sucks that I lost my general. Because I really needed one. I really needed him. I need him to die the way he did, but I always forget how finicky um, morale is in this game. The unit's break at the drop of a hat, it seems like. They don't handle morale shock at all. They just, just fight, 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 fight. Like, the general dies, and the whole army just breaks. In unison. Just sh What? No, that's not how it works. Army wouldn't break instantaneously. Just everyone, a full health unit of 70, 80 troops, just breaks, runs off the field. All right. I forget how fragile generals are in this game. They die so quick. But I think later in the later Total Wars, they actually do stuff to actually help keep your general alive better. They move them around in the formation and stuff like that. Like in the... Um, uh, <clears throat> the... Um, Total War Attila, the units, they're always on the left, and then whenever they come inside, they actually move a little spot for them, and then the center of the formation behind shields, and so they they do a lot of stuff to protect them in later Total Wars. And then with Total War Warhammer, your general's like a one-man wrecking crew. He can normally kill two to three elite units. So, <clears throat> especially when he's fully upgraded, he just rolls through stuff. And he gives them mounts and all this other stuff where they just run. Ramp it through your lines. These loading times are ridiculous. I may start editing them out. Repeat! Can do that, sir. Yes. Keep sure. ready. First sir. of all. Sir. Sir. Yes, Stratigos. Do that. Yes, Stratigos. My archers are Orders. completely devastated. Yes, Stratigos. Should not have lost this many men. Whatever. Alright, so that's a trireme. What do I have in Capia? Well, I am recruiting some troops. So I have an archer unit, some levies, a phalanx men, and a ballista. And then I have some troops being... Yep, and then I can also, if I win a battle, I can get some troops. Um, you stay there. You're going north. That's my faction leader. Yeah, you keep going north. Uh, everybody else. There's not much I can do. So, we'll end turn and see what happens. That sucks that I lost my general. Oh, um, go there. To. Out of Musa. Uh, that's unfortunate. Because with that one move, that sets us back a turn at least. 
possibly more. And should have shattered them in the field. Instead, they shattered my advance. Hello, Thrace. What are you doing? Think very carefully before you reply. Hmm. Our thanks. Sure. I don't need a war with Thrace right now. Could have accepted a war with Thrace if I wasn't in such financial Advance. problems. Mystery, mystery, mystery. Keep going. Go for that. That'll be the most money you get. Ready to sail! Prepare to engage! The sea is out! Well, we're winning on the sea. Not so much anywhere else. Right. Ready to sail! But I think we did. You go there. Alright, so what can yes, we do? Merge you. My lord. Merge y'all up. Alright. So doing that. I need to do some retraining. You, 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 you. All y'all get retrained. My lord. Alright, so what do you have? Very depleted force. The force is depleted. I did, did kill their faction leader in the fight. He is their factionary now. These troops are depleted. These troops are all but depleted, and he's just hanging out there. If they lose this siege, it's over for them. Let's see where my diplomat's at. My lord? Yes, my lord. Yeah, that's Spain. Yes, my lord. Oh, right there. I shall speak with them at once. I get a trade line. A most generous proposal. Okay, so they like that. And then... Offer alliance? No. Alright, we'll just do that. Yes. So we got a trade agreement with them. That should help monetary wise. Alright, so Athens. What do you have for me? Yes, Stratigos. Mars! Uh that light lance is not really needed. Here that's being built by here. Pre Calvary, we have a unit of pre Calvary. That Apollo, that's fine. Yes, Salonia, you go there. That'll hold. Yes, go Forward. north. Attack. And you Just see what they're doing. You camp there. Oh, yeah, they're trying to take that settlement. That's a very battered force that we could do something with. And here, you're all spearmen again, so we should be able to smash all that completely. I don't have a general, which is highly unfortunate. But, we are gathering reinforcements. I could send my faction here, which I probably am. And, we will wait a few more turns and we'll gather up a force and then reinforce Capia and then maybe push on Rome. Hello! Defeat. Roll for your lives. I always think it's funny that if you have a fleet nearby, your defeated army will always go into the fleet instead of the settlement. They need to be going to the settlement, not the fleet, but whatever. <laughs> well, that didn't go over well. I mean, well, it didn't go over at all. Hello. Race or being you on bad terms or something. Appear so. So if that's the case. Don't need cavalry, need defensive units. A lot of them. Looks like they're getting a little uppity. So. Need troops for the mobile machine, please. Ships ready! Like Greek city states. Smash the, the pieces. General. General here. Can you get me mercenary wise? That'll work. Order 
There's another... I don't have a lot of family members left. I got one down here. Is there no way I can recruit some more? Do I got any people I can adopt? Super husband? Yes. There we go. That works. So now I have a general. In case they get uppity. Yes, um, you. Yes, Stratagos! Out here, who can give me no mercenaries? Fantastic. But yes, Platagos. Onward. Mercenaries. That's sad. All right, here. March. Sir, march. Yes, Go, you. My lord. My phalanx march. forces. You're over from the mainland, so I need you mustering Forward. just west of Capia. We'll gather what troops we can. Uh, Macedonian cavalry, you've been smashed, so you're not really going to help at all. Uh, what can we get? Greek stables would be nice. Is there anything that can get me better than that? Now I got economics going. Economics, economics. Yeah, there's really nothing I can go there. So, next. Cavalry stables. Blacksmith. Go next here. Prepare that. That's all we need. Sir. You go north and smash hey. this Golic army. No. Oh. That's not even. Okay, whatever. It's not even close. Oh, these are swords. Okay. No, still, that is, that's not even close. We'll smash it the ribbons. Push them and then we'll come in from the north and the south and deal with them, hopefully. The problem is, is it takes so long to recruit, recruit units in this game. You can't recruit multiple, like, you can't set like, you know, three units recruiting a turn, only one recruits per turn. And I think that was a mechanic in the original Rome Total War was... Uh, single recruitment you could recruit more than one. It sucks, but it is what it is. This music's on point, though. It's definitely good. There we go. A little bit better. Low times. If we smash this horse and take Salonia, that would be good. We have some money stocked up, so I'm not too worried about it. Rome actually has built up their territory really nice. Allowing us to get top level troops, which is fine. Tonight, nope, no speeches. Then actually, full main wide line. Which plays to my favor. Should be able to entice them into a fight. That's a far choosing. All warmed up. Stretch yourself. Javelins. Away. Archers. Away. 
Ballista, commence fire. Do we have a line of sight? I think we do. Tough fire. I'll goat them into attacking. That rot flank is very weak. Commence firing when in range. Can I walk you forward? Oh, I can. Cool. Full arrows. Come forward. There we go. Now they're within range. Come on, start javelin. I know they'll start firing. Ah, there we go. They'll start firing. That'll go them into a fight. Come the javelins. Oh, yeah. Got a few kills in. Might go them into a fight. Got some swordsmen. Fire there. Get high. Firing on them. Archer, what are you doing? Get back. You too as well. Run, why are you? Well, the Peltas, that one Peltas unit just got screwed over. Fire. How, how did you... In. Oh, that's not going to go well. War band. Clear shattering. That's not going to go well. Barbarian Warlord Cavalry is going to be a problem. Protect the war band. Get them. Bring them down. Now they're shattering and breaking. They're all breaking. The wool band. Boom. Should end with our victory. The enemy general flees. Press forward so that the spirit of his army is a broken tool. Why are you not charging? Go. Now they're all routing. Perfect. They're all 
routing off the field. All right, who's left? They are left. All right, we'll just Unit, make haste. allow them to retreat. I could catch them, but I think I'd lose too many. The gods have favored you. Well, that went a whole lot better because my general didn't die. Help yourself. General dies. It'll be a complete and utter rout. Got it. And also, the AI will be very, very defensive. As much as possible. I guess because the pikes were so elongated, they just ran over the... the uh, they broke through the... A cab unit shouldn't be able to do that to a pike unit head on. Even in a very elite level cab unit shouldn't be able to do that. The spears would prevent them from doing that. smashed what is, what is, we may have concern. to pull back war dead war dead my lord so you yes, scrappy sir war dead march you go north march to be in force war dead the remainder of these troops march are going there so, what can i gather as mercenaries Or something. This force is moving in, and then we'll reinforce it, and then push, hopefully, into Rome. A second attempt. Because, you know, we can't just do it the first time. We have to go all in. Alright, Rome, what are you wanting? <laughs> that, uh, that merchant is totally running ramshack over them. Which is hilarious. Sir. Stop with the... That's just irritating. Yeah, keep going that way. Also, let me know how the steps Sir. is going. Alright. Alright, so... My lord. March. We'll Sir. have troops assembled. I have almost no cavalry. My lord, sir. My lord, march. But I will have plenty of archers. My lord, forward. What do they give me? One, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, with six archers. Okay. War dead, onward. My lord, forward. My lord, move out. Yes, Dragon. Any mercenaries I can get a hold of. Some mercenary hoplites. Yes, Alright, move there. Bunch. We'll see exactly what they're going to do. They are very depleted. So, I wonder if going for him and then turning and facing this direction would be the worst idea. They may get aggressive and attack me. Alright, probably not. They're kind of sequestered. Yes, I'll give you another cav unit. Alrighty. Move out. So they're in the middle Head. of the. Forward. Yes, Stratigos. Yes, Stratigos. Sir, my lord. Move west, and you're going to come here. Forward. 
No, you're gonna move there. Bring this fleet up. And we'll move you across. Alright. How are we doing? Some more levies on that end. It'll help. Alright, Athens. What are we doing? Uh, no, we're fine. Sparta. Greek cavalry would be nice. Come on, what are we doing? That and that. When can we get a... Probably need to get that. And then that would help as well. Nothing else. Probably the blacksmith. That. Paper roads. That. And then you can move farming. Capia, uh, how are we doing? Is there anything we can do? Uh, Shrine of Zeus. Blacksmith would also be good. Wait, what am I getting there? Ah, Phalanx Pikeman. That's what I'm doing. That's right. More of those. How much am I down? Ooh, income. We are down 400. Okay. Well, we should be okay. Yes, Pushing here. Yes, here. Destroy them. Begin the siege. Wait, no, I should be able to assault and take the settlement. Oh yeah. Perfect. Uh, we will occupy. Should turn us around. Yeah, plus a thousand. Perfect. All right, now I want them to try to assault me in a siege scenario. I don't think that's going to work in their favor. Sir. Especially since we're bringing up reinforcements. Out. We'll reinforce there. Here we're kind of stuck there, so let's in turn. I really thought that was going to be a victory. Ooh, they've sent them back. In an auto resolve. Julia Navy, you're being very persistent. Very persistent. Pavalia is not happy about something. Now they're in the red. It's like they're probably taxes of the wager. Alright, so we have yes, forces in the area sir. to deal with any sir, to deal with any problems. Do we have anything here? Okay. All that. Get away. I need new stuff. New family member. Ooh, nice. Retinue expands. Nice. Okay, all that's good. So they separated these out into different reports. That's nice. Okay. Now, here. Ah, you're gonna block my way, are you? No. That probably won't draw all those troops in. There we go. This is what I'm talking about. Alright, so if we defeat this army in the field, Kill their faction leader and then hopefully go after Scipio. We'll probably do that next turn. Ah. Alright, so this is going to have to be a very quick battle. Dinner is ready. So as soon as this battle is over, I'll be rushing off to uh, eat me some supper. Kind of a stormy day today. I was sitting there in, in school and it was pouring down rain. Um, had some lightning. Luckily, no, nothing really severe, but it rained pretty hard. It was raining hard enough that uh, you could take a shower outside very easily. Like in 30 seconds, just run out, all soaked up, done, run back inside. And it was a cold rain too. It was not a, uh, like a warm rain, it was cold. Here in Texas, we've been getting so much water here lately. Uh, it's Day has dawned. On my order. Yeah. Watches. Come up. 
Oh, I love fighting in these, uh, these fields. It's awesome. These little fields. Okay. And... General, there. The enemy have brought up more reinforcements in a futile attempt to They're save themselves. There. Coming in at different locations. Okay. Alright, so you three. You're gonna be a battle group. You go that direction. You here. Their faction leader will be okay. Move over. Sped it up a little bit so it won't take nearly as long. Where they just going? To sleep. Move here. How are we doing here? The Roman leader flees. A floating eagle turns into a clucking hen. <laughs> the enemy army is in flight. Pursue them. Drive them from the battlefield. All right, so they're running. Turn and attack them. Charge. Hit them in the back. Javelins. Should cause them to retreat. The enemy general is Perfect. slain, and now his men fear us. It is time to press the attack. Right, they're running. We'll go after them. Oh, those are Velites. That's nice. Uh, they'll turn back. The gods be praised! The enemy's hearts are full of fear, and now they flee! They should be. Destroy them! Uh, come on. Kill those Astati, come on. Come on, kill them, kill them, kill them. There we go, they're dead. Trari, that's a valiant effort, but I don't think that's going to be anywhere. Go after them. Come around here. There we go. The enemy general is slain, and now he's them, And it is over. God be praised. So we've caught them outside of the settlement. Now we just have Scipio to deal with, but we'll deal with that next episode. So as soon as this ends, we'll be ending the episode. I hope you enjoyed it. Nice of battles. We had the catastrophe outside of Rome, which shall not be repeated. But uh, press F for respects to uh, I can't remember his name, but uh, to our gallant general. Press F for respects. So now there's just four faction leaders. He's still alive. But we'll go here to Scipio, that may not bring them in, and then we can kill him and then besiege Rome itself. Which will probably be besieged for a while. What the? Oh, they rebelled. They rebelled on me. I did not see that. That is interesting. I don't know what they have. Did they bribe it? Oh, they bribed it. I forgot there's bribing in this game, so they bribed the uh, the settlement into taking their side. That's wonderful. Okay, so without further ado, we will pick back up with the assault on Rome, and hopefully we can get rid of that diplomat bribing my troops. So without further ado, this has been Moyi here. I hope you have a good rest of your day, and I will see you in the next one. Also, don't forget to like, rate, and subscribe. It really helps the channel out. Have a good day.